what the Spirit <laughs> says unto the churches. Yeah. And unto the angel of the church of the Laodiceans, write. These things saith the Amen. The faithful and true witness, the beginning of the creation of God. I know thy works, that thou art neither cold nor hot. I would that thou were cold or hot. So then, because thou art lukewarm and neither cold nor hot, I will spew thee out of my mouth. Because thou sayest, I am rich, and increase with goods, and have need of nothing, and knowest not that thou art wretched, and miserable, and poor, and blind, and naked. I cancel thee to buy me gold tried in the fire that thou mayest be rich. Don't people I know rich tonight as God's people. Yeah, I'm people And white raiment that thou mayest be clothed and the shame of thy nakedness do not appear. And anoint thine eyes with eye say that thou mayest see. As many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Be zealous, therefore, and repent. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come in to him and will sup with him and he with me. To him that overcometh will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame and sat down with my Father in his throne. He that have an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Now, I want to talk to you a few minutes on these churches. They was good people in all seven of the churches. Amen. And Jesus Christ was in those churches. Come on. In the first chapter of the book of Revelation, John saw him walking in the midst of the golden candlestick, which are the seven churches of Asia. When God gets in the church, it's going to be shouting. <laughs> Amen. Come on now, church, loosen up a little bit. Preaching Jesus. Glory to God. He was walking in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks, which are the seven churches of Asia. And neighbor, let me tell you this afternoon that God knows what was going on in the church. Amen. We don't have anything hid from God Almighty. There's an all-seen eye looking down tonight. God knows where we're at tonight. Amen. Amen. I want to tell you folks this afternoon, these seven churches are the type of the church ages which we've been living in. Amen. Amen. Every time the church gets wrong, Messy Lord. Yea, the Lord said, the Lord knows your works. But the Lord has someone against me. Because you've left your first blood. Yeah. Amen. 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 Sometimes I had to go back to the altar where I was saved. See if I had the love of the Lord to have. Amen. Amen. Thank God forever. Let me tell you folks, this afternoon, this church had lived its first love. Amen. But the Lord said, remember from which thou hast fallen and repent. Do thy first work. I'll come quickly. 
Jesus. He lied to you to be. People used to shout. Amen. Brother, when I first started, 50 years ago, neighbor, bless your heart, it had sang like we had tonight. It better run me out. Shout the praises of God. Amen. We live down somewhere. Praise the Lord this afternoon. Amen. We're living in a changing world. Because God does not change tonight. Praise God this afternoon. We're the one of change. We live down, brother. Our standard tonight. Amen. The times of sin, brother, a hundred years ago, is still sin tonight. Amen. And thank God if we sin, we need to repent of our sin. And get right with God. Praise God this afternoon. Amen, people. Lay out of church a lot of time. Amen, when they don't need to. Amen, the Bible said, if we know to do good and do it not, to me it's a sin tonight. Amen, we don't have too much repentance in our church world anymore. Amen, but let me tell you folks, Thank God it's just an insert tonight uh, to repent of our sins uh, as the Lord when we first got saved. Amen. Preaching, Lord. Oh, well, that was God. Bless him, God. Bless him, God. Bless him, Jesus. <laughs> Every one of these churches had good Christian people in them. Amen. The Lord knows the good. <laughs> And the Lord knew the bad. Yeah, right. Amen. We've got to deal with the bad. Yeah, right. Long we're here in this world. Yeah, right. Amen. But God Almighty going to separate us yeah, right. at the resurrection. Yeah. Praise God Almighty. The bad ain't a going. Yeah, right. Thank God the good's a going. Yeah, right. The heaven in this life is over, man. Yeah, right. Can't right. be good without Jesus. Yeah, that's right, Lord. You may think you're good. Come on. <laughs> but you're not. Listen, Listen. Listen. There's people in this big world tonight, there's people that's been born again. Amen. Amen. They preach you right. Amen. Amen. They'll walk right. Amen. Hallelujah. They'll talk right. Amen. Thank God this afternoon. Bless him. Oh, neighbor. I'm just laying their foundation now. Praise God this afternoon. Let me tell you folks. Amen. The church. Amen. Those six churches run their course. Amen. Went on down the road. And they ended up cold. It wasn't even cold or hot. Amen. They were lukewarm. They had works in the church. But they made the Lord sick. Thank God our work is not God's spirit. It's a sound of grace and a changing sympathy. Amen. Let me tell you folks tonight, the signal is tonight the coming of the Lord. It's right at the door tonight. Amen. I don't have to go out of Boone County to tell you, brother, Jesus is a coming real soon. Amen. Our churches are cold and indifferent. Yes, they are. Amen. Let me tell you, folks, did you know this world tonight is a trying to rule out all the shouting, all the aliens. The devil don't want you to holler hallelujah. Thank God if you'd get happy. Yeah. You might cause me to get happy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh Lord, that's the way it works out. Yeah. Yeah. I think this thing flows yeah. from breast to breast. Yeah. Yeah. That's a call we're all hooked up yeah. to the same paradigm. Yeah. 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 How are we doing, Jimmy? Doing great. Thank you, guys. Preaching Jesus. Blessing God. 
In the first part of the book of Revelation, those seven churches, Jesus is in the midst of them. Amen. And now I read in your presence what did run their course. Amen. He was on the outside, knocking on the door. Everybody said, Behold, I stand at the door now. If any man will hear my voice and open the door, he said, I'll come in and sup with him. And he with me. Thank God we're going to have Jesus in our midst. Got to give him a hearty welcome this afternoon. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Got something for you tonight. The Lord's ready to make His return. You leaders are coming again. Amen. He said, if it were not so, I would have told you. The Lord said, He's coming again. He said, let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God. We've all Yeah. Oh, you might well 
Okay. Right. I don't have to go out of Boone County, brother, to show you the sign Jesus coming real soon. They wouldn't let me preach in Madison. <laughs> they got the door closed again, old time preaching. Amen. That's a sign of the Lord to come. Uh, Amen. 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 I want to tell you, folks, when He comes, He's a coming out to them that He bought and paid for yeah. with yeah. His own blood. Yeah. Amen. 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 And He coming out to the sinners. Happy. No worry in the Scripture tell you the sinner's going to get up no. with the church. Like Dr. Trevor, ain't nobody getting up but them been born again. Yeah. The Lord comes to descend from heaven with a shout with the voice of an archangel and with the trump of God. He said the dead in Christ shall rise first that we that live and remain shall be called up together with in the cloud to meet the Lord in the air. See, preach, I will see Jesus for a day. That's what it is. God knows my heart. Right. <laughs> my mom died when I was about six years old. My dad died in 1948. I just started preaching. And I had the privilege to go pray with him on his sick bed. I was there when he made the confession. I said, how do you feel, Dad? He said, I feel better in ways I ever felt in my life. Yeah. Amen. Amen. You know when you get saved. Yeah, that's right. Praise God, you feel yeah. clean. Amen. 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 Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. The blood of Jesus Christ Amen. don't leave no garbage in your life. Amen. Praise God, it sweeps it all out tonight. Amen. 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 God forever. He makes you a child of the king tonight. Amen. 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 Just like a natural baby when it's born in the world. Thank God when you when you get saved, you're a babe in Christ. And amen. Tonight I got saved on February the second. Thank God fifty years ago. I just met the child of God that night as I am tonight. All things have changed in me. I just grew in the grace and in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. Glory Amen. Amen. Edward Rich. The Lord said, Buy me gold right in the car. Yeah. yeah. I said to make an over Christian. <coughs> Landville. Yeah. A good preacher came in and sit down with some of me and said, the church hadn't started. He said, Dick, he said, you got any gold? I said, yeah, I've got gold. Been tried in the fall. <laughs> he said, I ain't talking about that kind of gold. He said, I'm talking about literal gold. I said, no, sir, I never have had any gold. He said, you had now slipped in the gold field. He said, the box. <laughs> now I've got both kinds of gold. <laughs> Man, I ain't gonna get out of tonight. Will you let me preach all night? Yeah. Yes, sir. I'll let you preach all night tonight. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay. So you're naked. You said your eyes are closed. Yeah, I've been I'll give you some eyes, say. Yeah. Uh, Brother, God's got her tonight. Yeah. Yeah. This gospel opened your eyes. Yeah. Show yeah. 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 Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. People can't see it. Amen. More than you. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. The Lord said, "Except you're born again, you cannot see the kingdom of God." Yeah. 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 Amen. Yeah. 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 Yes, it is. Yeah. This natural man receives not the things of the Spirit of God. That's right. They're foolishness unto him. Yeah. 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 That's right. 
Amen. Because they're spiritually discerned tonight. Right. Uh, Amen. Uh, I've tried to read the Bible to understand before I got saved. I said it's a dirty shame. Uh, ain't read that book. I lived up on docks and fork. And I think I'll just read you through. And I got to reading. The first thing I know, my mind was up. These honky yeah, box and mess. <laughs> I didn't know what I was reading until I got the scales off my eyes. Amen. 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 I know what I've been reading, folks. I'll tell you the Lord's coming real soon. Yeah. Amen. That's right. He said, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man in that load of sin church will hear my voice and will open the door. Of course, that was an actual door. There's a spiritual knock on your heart tonight. You got the door shut against him tonight. And if you don't let the Lord in, you say you just sleep in the rain or stay out in the cold. The lock's on the inside. If you don't unlock it, brother, God never will come in your life. So he said, you want to get saved? Yeah, I want to get saved. Let's pray. No, he said, I don't want to pray right now. Yeah. You don't want to get saved? Start with that's it. Right. That's right. Amen. Right. Right. That's the truth. You want to get saved, you'll do something about it tonight. Yeah. Come on now. Amen. Hold my hands up now. Bless him. Bless him. Listen carefully, friends. Right after the doors of the closed doors of the Laodicean church, what happened? Behold, a door was opened in heaven. I heard a voice speaking to me. Said that to me as a blur trumpet. Said, come up hither. You know who it was? Thy God is the time of the rapture tonight. Son. Was a representative of the church. And God was going to call him up. Amen. Thank God it's time for the rapture tonight. Amen. Now we, brother, this lives in church age. It's just about over with it. Amen. Amen. You don't have to think what this preacher is saying. Well, i got to give him the count. Right. That's right. My spirit ship to God. That's yeah. right. Bless him, Jesus. Amen. The Lord's coming. Yes, Are you ready? Amen. Listen, friends. He was called up in the heaven. Yes. Yes. <coughs> Amen. He was in the spirit. Amen. That's Amen. how I'm going up. Amen. And if you ain't born again, you ain't going nowhere. Right. That's right. Amen. 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 Jesus said, except you're born again, you cannot enter into the kingdom of man. That's the truth. He was caught up into heaven. He saw what you and I are going to see. And he saw the throne of God, the big rainbow around. <laughs> you want to know what he saw at the end of the flood? He saw a rainbow. God was telling Noah, he said, you're stepping into a new day. Yes, sir. <laughs> Amen. 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 God, that's what God was telling the church. Thank God, brother, we're going to step into a new day. Amen. It's Amen. new days of dawning, friends. Amen. It's closer than we think it is. Amen. I want to say this again tonight. God lets me live a little while longer. I'm already 80 years old. God lets me live a little while longer. I won't even have to die. I'll just be changed in a moment. If you don't believe in shouting, you better not get on that cloud. Bless him, Jesus. Bless him, Jesus. Bless him, Jesus. Yeah, that's some ups and downs. <laughs> I preached down there two weeks where this fellow lived that. Not a soul got saved. I went up to Morrisville and started a meeting. 
And then the first week, it was 27 souls got saved. <laughs> Brother, I don't understand the Lord a lot of times. He knows what he's doing. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 Tommy yeah. got in. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. John, don't preach a while. <laughs> Come on. Let's God ain't running for both of us up here. I'll preach in the back end. <laughs> Listen to me, friends. Close This early church turned the world upside down. Uh-huh. Now the world's got the church people turned upside down. <laughs> For me tonight. Right. Amen. 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 God said, Love not the world. Folks, I preach like I feel, I'll preach you a real sermon here tonight. That's in Jesus. Listen, friends. The fourth chapter of the book of Revelation and the fifth chapter of the book of Revelation is telling. You what we're going to see when we leave here. Yeah. Well, he saw the 24 hours. Yeah. I believe he saw the heavenly choir that's yeah. going to sing up there. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you don't matter choir, it's going to be over in heaven. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. 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 Here's the sad part of it. He showed John what was going to happen to a lost world yeah. when the church leaves here. Amen. 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 Yeah, yeah, the Antichrist, yeah. the beast, the false prophet, yeah. going to have a full swing in the earth. Yeah. You don't believe in the Trinity. Yeah. Hey, man, God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost. He's going to be a, a Trinity here, brother, after the church leaves here. Yeah. He ain't going to be God either. Amen. Amen. Be the God of this world. Amen. Amen. Anti-God and anti-Christ and anti-spirit. Yeah. I got you thinking, ain't I? Yeah, good Lord. Blessing Jesus, preaching Lord. That was after the door was open in heaven. The sixth chapter of the book of Revelation tells you the wrath of God that's going to be poured upon this world. Twenty-one judgments under them seals. Listen, folks. God's going to pour out His wrath upon this world. I don't know the one hiding place. And that's in the crucified yeah, Savior. Right. Amen. Right. 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 I'll be with Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The judgment seat of Christ yeah, and the marriage of the Lamb. Yeah, yeah. We're getting married, praise God. Yeah, yeah. I'm already engaged. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Woo! Hallelujah. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. We're getting married to somebody ain't never seen. Amen. 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 Only I see the Lord, the invisible God. It's by faith tonight. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Look at me carefully. Don't get married to somebody you ain't seen. We have a type and a shadow of it yeah. in the 24th right. chapter of the book of Genesis. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Amen? Yeah. You remember when yeah. Abraham sent that servant? That's, right. That's the type of the Spirit of God. Yeah. Amen? Amen? Went down there to get Rebecca yeah. for Isaac's bride. He had never seen her. He was out in the field in the evening time. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He looked up and he said, Behold the cameras are coming. Yeah. 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 Hey, we're not going to ride the camel train, brother. We're going to ride the clouds of glory. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to get on that cloud. Sometimes I made to leave, brother. It's the same cloud that followed this all the way through the wilderness. Praise God this afternoon. Let me tell you, folks. Thank God when they get on board. Thank God 
And if you don't leave and shout, you better not get on board than me. Because I'm going to have a spell this afternoon. Amen. Bless him. Bless him, Jesus. Bless him, Lord. Take us to the judgment seat of Christ. Bless him, Jesus. Yeah. Going to be gone seven years. Help him, Lord. Then I'm going to get on board a white horse. Amen. I'm going to follow Jesus. He's going to be on a white horse. Now I think long. <laughs> Somebody said that don't mean a white horse. I believe John had since I know what a white horse was. He said it was a white horse. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. hey, praise the Lord. He said why? It's a preaching Jesus. Bless now you, Lord. I'm going to tell you this and then we'll close. I went down and picked him. That's on the Jordan side, I think, about 70 miles from the Red Sea. Bless him, Lord. And he's a rap. He was bringing our horses out there for me to ride about two miles down in there. <laughs> they bring out a black horse. I'd well, we're over another corner somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Bring another kind of horse that I didn't like. I'd get somewhere else. Finally, they bought out a big old white horse. I said, that's mine. <laughs> I got a picture of myself on that white horse, and I rode that thing down in Petra. <laughs> I didn't understand that fellow. He talked to me all the way down there. I didn't know what I'd say. <laughs> I said, you understand me? <laughs> Let me tell you this, folks. I'm going to close. I don't believe a man sleeps in the graveyard. I don't believe in soul sleeping. I'm going to tell you why I don't believe in it. In the sixth chapter of the book of Revelation, then people that got saved through the tribulation period, I think mostly Jews, maybe some heathen nations got saved. They lost their head for their testimony of Jesus Christ. And God put them on the altar in heaven. And they hollered out and said, How long? Oh Amen. Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. They talk. Amen. Everybody said, yes. Lay around the graveyard till the resurrection morning. That ain't the way it is, neighbor. I believe them people have died in the triumph of Jesus Christ as much alive tonight. I believe them that died in sin and hell tonight are much alive this afternoon.